All right, now recently I posted a video in which I discussed about a couple of features which Samsung is going to remove from the Galaxy phones when we update the phones to One UI 7.0. And most of you guys were not happy about it and some of you guys did not understand what exactly is happening there. So in this video, I want to throw some more light on this and uh, clarify or explain you guys what exactly is happening with these two features. So let's dive right into the video. Now, the first thing is with regard to the edge panels, Samsung will not make the edge panels available on the Galaxy Store on One UI 7.0, which means you will not be able to download edge panels from the Galaxy Store. But if you have already downloaded the edge panel on your Galaxy phone and then you update it to One UI 7.0, then those edge panels will be available on your Galaxy phone. Now, if you are new to Samsung, let me first tell you what is the edge panel. This is where the edge panel is and you can swipe towards the right or left to access uh, different edge panels the default ones and the ones that you have downloaded from the galaxy store and when you tap on the uh, the settings button here at the bottom you see it takes us to this page here where you already have a few default panels which can be selected now you can see i have selected the apps clipboard weather tools voice changer and uh, yeah so these are the ones which i have selected and if i want to download more I could always go to Galaxy Store here and here we have got multiple different options. We got paid uh, edge panels, free edge panels and some newly released edge panels which are available on the Galaxy Store. Now Samsung is going to take down this option. We will not have any edge panels available on the Galaxy Store. And what you need to do is you need to now go ahead to the Galaxy Store before updating it to One UI 7. You can download these edge panels, the paid ones or the free ones, whatever you need, you can download them and those edge panels will be available even after you upgrade your phone to One UI 7.0. Let me show you where exactly that is going to be available. I'll open the Galaxy Store. Now I'll tap on menu option and tap on my applications. On the top you see we have got this option my apps. This is where you will have all those edge panels. Now I'm not sure whether Samsung is going to add one more option here to this as edge panels or whether it will be available under the app section here. You see these are the apps which I have already downloaded, uh, the ones which are already available and the ones which I have downloaded and uninstalled. Those are also available here. As you can see we have got a few edge panels here. MyTube Edge, Wiki, Rolet Edge, RSS Panel for Edge, Direct Call Panel, Panel. These are the panels which uh, can be downloaded here. But before upgrading to One UI 7, make sure you download the ones that you want. Uh, if you have already downloaded it, it will show up here and you can re-download it here or you can just go to the edge panel, tap on this icon, go to the Galaxy Store, download the one you want. So that is what you need to do to retain all these edge panels once you upgrade it to One UI 7.0. So this means we are not losing the edge panel feature. The edge panel will be available on your Galaxy phone. Now this edge panel you see here, this option will always be there. You will have the recently used applications or the smart select and all these options will be available here. And you will also have the apps that you added here. You can tap on this icon to add the applications on this particular edge panel. That will also be available. And when you swipe towards the right, we have got some default edge panels like this weather. And we have got tools here, which includes compass and a few other options. And we also have voice changes. So these are some default edge pan panels which may be made available by default and rest of them will be taken out from the Galaxy Store. Now Samsung may be doing this because not many people are downloading the edge panels from the Galaxy Store. We are only using the default ones, the important ones and we don't see any new panels getting added here on the uh, edge panels store. All these panels I've been seeing since years and they are only available. There are There is no new panels which are being added. So this feature has kind of become redundant. If you ask me, I don't really use edge panels uh, only when it is necessary. I use it, but many of you guys may be using it. So for those of you guys who use edge panels extensively, you need to make sure you download the panels that you want from the Galaxy Store because it will not be available anymore in the store for you to download. That is the first thing that I wanted to clarify. Now the second one is DeX application on Windows PC. Now some of you guys thought that uh, Samsung is removing the DeX feature itself for the PC. Now that is not happening. We will have DeX available on the PCs, but we will be able to connect it wirelessly. Now there is a drawback there. If we connect the uh, DeX feature wirelessly, then the resolution is not gonna be great on the PC and the connectivity will be slow, the file transfer speeds will be slow. So these issues will be there, uh, but if we have wired connection on DeX application, it is faster and in higher resolution and more efficient. So that feature would have been great if we had, uh, but it looks like Samsung is removing the DeX application on the PCs, which is a bummer. 
Now, if you did not know, Samsung offers a feature called Samsung DeX, which converts your mobile phone's operating system into a fully blown PC experience on a larger screen. We can connect it on the monitors, we can connect it on TVs wirelessly, we can connect it on the car's infotainment system. So it's a brilliant feature which is offered by Samsung. Now, one of the ways to connect DeX on the PC is going to go away after we upgrade the phone to One UI 7.0. And Samsung says we can use the phone link app or link to Windows application to cast the screen on the PC to transfer the files or to do anything that we do on the phone can be done on the larger screen on the PC using Link to Windows application. And I would say Link to Windows is also quite efficient and it is pretty good. But yeah, if you want that desktop looking experience, then that will not be available on Link to Windows application. Now again, I'm not sure how many users are there who use the Dex feature on the PCs through wire uh, using the Dex application on the PC. Samsung would definitely have the database and maybe considering the number of users, Samsung is going to remove this feature or maybe there are some technical aspects to this i'm not very sure we are going to lose that samsung dex application from the microsoft store on the pcs which is again a bummer now this is something which i wanted to clarify and talk about in this video now if you're into edge panels make sure to download the edge panels that you love keep them on your phone so that you don't lose them after upgrading your phone to one ui 7 and as far as the dex feature is concerned we are anyways going to lose it you can use the link to windows option or you can wirelessly cast the dex on the pcs as long as your pc is rocking the mira cast feature built inside it so that is something you need to note that's about it that's all i want to share with you guys if you're interested in this cool looking wallpaper the link is in the description every video i post will have a brand new wallpaper and if you want to know more about this widget again the link is in the description this is a widget from a widget pack called frizzy kwgt you need to make sure you buy this this particular pack and you also have kwgt pro application installed on your phone only then you'll be able to add these widgets on the home screen i've already posted a couple of tutorial videos about this if you want to know about it drop a comment i will reply to you guys and yeah, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to know your phone better and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.